lot of Filipinos are addicted to Korean culture. May it be K-drama, K-pop, fashion, or food. So we wouldn't miss the chance to visit South Korea. For our first day, my twin sister Ella and I did a walking tour to Korea's famous city spots. First stop, Joksugong Palace. It's one of the five grand palaces of the Joseon dynasty. We were able to witness the change of royal guards before we entered. Then a few meters walk, you will reach the Chonggyechon Stream, which is a public recreation space in downtown Seoul. Nearby the stream is the Gwangwamun Square where you will see the statue of King Sejong and Admiral Yi sun -si. You can also enter a museum down the statues. And at the end of the square, you will reach the Jongbokgung Palace. Best way to visit here is by renting a Korean traditional dress which is called the Hanbok. So you can really feel and took pictures like a true Korean. We also stopped by the Changyokgung Palace and Changyonggung Palace. The next day, we spent all day at Everland. It is the South Korea's largest theme park. We rode some rides. Watch the parade. waited for the spectacular show and fireworks. For our third day, our twin friends Kating and Tenten joined our trip. Our first destination is the Hanyul Park, which is celebrating its Silver Grass Festival during our visit. Then the Bukchon Hanok Village where you can see traditional Korean houses. And of course, we wouldn't miss the Ensoul Tower which is a well-known K-drama location. You can also see here thousands of law blocks all around the place put by couples, family, or friends. Then we stop by the house of Lee Min Ho in Legend of the Blue Sea. After that, we roam around the busy street of Myeongdong. The next day, we went to Nami Island. You need to ride a ferry for about 15 minutes to reach the island. Here, you can really feel the autumn vibe. It was really surreal and it's beautiful everywhere. This is also one of the recognized K-drama locations. I remember watching Winter Sonata when I was a teen. Then we're off the Garden of Morning Calm. It houses a lot of beautiful landscape gardens. You can enjoy the calmness of the flowers, plants, and trees around you. For our fifth day, we went to Petit France. This is a beautiful french style theme park in Gabyong. Then we traveled to Nari Park but sadly it is closed during our visit. So we just went to the Coex Mall to see the famous Starfield Library. It is a gigantic and Instagrammable public library located in the middle of a mall. As for their food, don't miss to try Sanggipsal, Kimbap, Chicken Duck Galbi, Bulgogi Stew, Cold Noodles, and a lot more. Exploring South Korea is truly one for the books. We will surely come back again soon. Till next time on Trip ni Marianne.